Salut Vincent. Salut. My dear Theo, this morning, at long last, the weather changed, and turned milder, I have been for several walks in the country hereabouts, but it is quite impossible to do anything in this wind. The sky is a hard blue with a great bright sun. I have seen lots of beautiful things. The orchards meant pink and white, the white deal, yellow, and the marine, blue. Perhaps now I shall begin to look around a bit for greens. I think the heat is still doing me good, in spite of the mosquitoes and flies. Dear Theo, I have a little room, with greenish gray paper, with two curtains of sea green, and a very worn armchair. Beside this one, there are more than 30 empty rooms. I have another one to work in. Dear <laughs> Theo, the treatment of patients in this hospital is certainly easy. They leave them to vegetate in idleness and feed them stale food. <sighs> Hi, Vincent. Hi, Vincent. Hi, Vincent. What's going on, Vincent? Hi, Vincent. Hi, 
Hi, Vanessa. Hi, Vanessa. my bedroom. Only the colors should work here, and through the simplification, which gives the things a larger style, peace, or complete sleep ought to be suggested. I hope, my dear Vincent, that your health is good. And since you say that you write with difficulty and don't talk about your work, I am a little afraid that there is something troubling you or not going right. In this case drop in to see Dr. Gadget. He will give you something to make you feel better. <laughs> 